My name is Lars Kronmark. I'm the chef instructor here at the Culinary Institute of America. Today we're going to use U.S. long grain rice and we're going to create a dish called jambalaya. If you like Cajun cooking, food from Louisiana, New Orleans, you like this dish. We're going to use smoked chicken, and dewy sausage, peppers and onions and celery, and a great seasoning mix to recreate this classic dish called jambalaya. First thing we need to do is to take the meat off the smoked chicken and pull the chicken in small pieces, somewhere between half an inch to one inch squares. Here is an example of the chicken that I'm going to use for the jambalaya. Combine the seasoning mix. We take the bay leaves, cayenne, oregano, the thyme, and the kosher salt and the pepper. Let's mix this together and set it aside. In a heavy saucepan, we're now going to saute the sausage a little crispy. Add the sausage. Let the sausage get a little crispy on a, few, on a couple of the sides. And the next step will be to add onions, the celery, and the bell pepper. We're going to saute this to uh, still firm, still a little crispy, but all coated in the fat from the sausage and from the olive oil. Let's go ahead and add the garlic. Next, we're going to add the chicken. Make sure everything is evenly mixed. Turn up the heat. After the chicken, let's add our seasoning mix, mixture. Sprinkle it in. Remember, we will pull out the bay leaves right before service. So leave them whole. Smells really delicious. After we add in the seasoning mix, let's add the chopped tomatoes. And the tomato sauce. Mix this together. And let's go ahead and add the chicken stock. I have here three cups of chicken stock. We're going to bring the jambalaya to a boil. And we're going to add the U.S. long grain rice, which we are going to Mix it very well. We're going to place this in a preheated 350 degree oven for about 20 to 25 minutes, either in the pot itself or in a hotel pan. And here we go, the bone coming to a boil. Add the rice.
mix it well. I'm going to bake this in the casserole that I started it in. And let's place it in the oven. Right in the middle. The jambalaya is done. When you see the rice have absorbed all the liquid, you pull out the bay leaves. There's number four. I like to serve this in a beautiful clay or ceramic dish like this. We're going to put a couple of scallions on top of this beautiful Long grain rice, smoked chicken and dewy sausage jambalaya. Please enjoy. <laughs> 